flop. Elizabeth has only seen 18% of the flop, so it hasn't been easy to get paid off because of her tight image. On the other hand, Tony G is playing very loose and reaping the rewards based on his stack size. Now, I don't expect Elizabeth to play like Tony, but now that she's got this image, it will only hurt her unless she learns to use it to her advantage. Well, Houston has reason to smile. She's inching closer to even and trying to turn a profit after 150 hands. I'll do it. She'll be under the gun I'll since Tony's straddling again. Consistency. In Russia, it's better. We have a very liberal rules for straddling. What are the rules? Any position, any amount you like. <laughs> Whatever you want, you can just put 10,000. People have, I mean, 100,000 I've seen. Wow. Well, straddle? All the time. $100,000 $100, straddle. All the time. If the guy... It's kind of hard to fold if like, you bought him really? for 150. <laughs> right? <laughs> Tony G committed there. Houston folds. Even 200, 400 game, you've seen 20,000 straddles. Daniel raises. Which is crazy. Joe's out. I've been working on... Uh... Reynolds folds. Corkins. Big slick. I raise the pot. Raises to 10 grand. I think Hoyt settled in. Tony, the straddler with a pocket pair. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm kind of committed here. Since Hoyt just showed up, he may not know that committed doesn't mean pot committed in the mathematical sense. Tony calls. So's Daniel. Join the party. It's just two chips. Daniel must like his odds of trying to run these two down. The flop. Ace, jack, six, a set for Tony. This is just dirty. Hoyt's probably going to have no idea he's behind here. He has top pair and fires 15,000. Tony's got him absolutely smashed. And repops to 65 grand. Easy fold for Daniel. Put a little pressure on. Maximum pot. Juice. At least you're not in. That means I got a chance for a fold. It's when they move straight in, then you <laughs> it. <laughs> Hoyt is in a wicked spot. <laughs> right, I'm drawing live, no matter what. Yeah, Believe yeah, me, you whatever you do, I'm alive in this hand. It's not like I'm putting my money in cold bed, you know? You know those implied odds I'm always prattling on about, how if you hit a set, you can get someone's entire stack? Well, that's what Tony's attempting to do here. Against some players, this would be an insta-fold, but Tony's reputation precedes him. You call 10,000 code, huh? All right, I'm all in. Corkin shoves and Tony calls. <laughs> Drawn real life. Hoyt sees how thin he's drawing. Wow. Unlucky. Yeah. How many times would you like to run it? I think I got to run it, what? 40 times to get one. <laughs> 40 times to win one. <laughs> you want to run twice? That one, that one. I mean, okay. right, we'll run twice, twice is good. Two times. Hoyt will need to hit runner, runner. Give you a chance. The first run, four spades on the turn. Hoyt's drawing dead. I wish. Do you want to run it once? Yeah, let's just run it once. <laughs> I make the so nuts. So Tony's won half the pot. Oh, wow. Yeah, absolute nuts. <laughs> All right, let's yeah. put something out there to give us a bit of hope. Okay? Dealer, I want a big card, a huge card. Hoyt's going to need two huge cards. The turn, it's a queen. Ooh, there it is. Now he needs a tan. Hoyt's picked up a straight draw. Ten to keep his money. I think you'll get it. I have a feeling you'll get it. The river, it's a king. How close was that? Tony gets the sweep. Okay, guys. Really? Hi, Hoyt. Bye, Hoyt. Take care. Take care. All right, Hoyt. <laughs> That's right. The Alabama Cowboy gets bucked off the big game and didn't even last eight seconds on the bull named Tony G. We're back after this.